Hi guys, thanks for coming back to the channel. Uh, quite an exciting video for you. Um, yesterday we finally managed to build my friend her first mining rig. It took a while. Uh, we got the parts last week and yesterday, Sunday, uh, we did build it. Uh, obviously I built it for her, she was uh, looking. Um, yeah, the rig is a complete copy of my uh, third mining rig, which was the MSI Gaming X1 AGB. Uh, she wanted everything to be exactly as my rig. She felt like I've got knowledge in terms of those parts and she didn't want to go for anything else. Although I did say to her we can go a different route. For instance, with the PCU we can get two instead of one. So it could work out cheaper. But no, she just wanted this one. So in this video, guys, let me show you the mining rig. Here it is. This is the rig in my house after being built, tested. It is working now, currently mining Ethereum. This is why I advise her to go for because it's the most profitable coin currently to mine when it comes to GPU mining. Um, yes, it is uh, not the best coin to go for if you want uh, more coins, uh, but in terms of dollars, it is the most profitable. And I did say to her, if, if you know, once she start earning, we can always exchange the Ethereum coins for something else. So you know, she agreed with me and now she is mining Ethereum. She's very happy with the rig is in her house. And yeah, things are going great. So now I'm gonna show you how much it cost us to build. I say us because obviously I helped her. I bought the parts, I, I built the rig. Um, so how much did it cost us to buy the parts and um, uh, how much obviously it costed the whole rig. Um, and then I'm gonna show you the ROI on the rig currently. Um, and yeah, it, it, I must say it's uh, much different than what it was uh, some time ago when I built my rigs. But uh, then again, I did say to her that you know, Ethereum now is a bit lower than what it was at, the, at its best price. If we look at the price of Ethereum at the moment, as we can see, it's two hundred and twenty-four dollars. We have seen Ethereum all the way to four hundred. So mining is all about patience at the moment, guys. Uh, keeping the coins for as long as we can, as much as we can. Um, and yeah, I did say to her if she can afford to pay the electricity without touching the coins, this will be probably the best uh, option for her. So, you know, she can obviously build her portfolio from the rig. And then once the Ethereum, let's say, go back to four five hundred dollars, then if she wants, she can sell and she will be able to bring her ROI much quicker once she obviously sell at that high price. But other than that, we will look at what are the the numbers right now and in a way this will give you an indication is it still worth to mine a mining rig uh, sorry to build a mining rig mining ethereum but i also said to her that uh, this rig is very versatile it's not just mining ethereum she can switch and mine a, a lot of other coins such as ethereum classic dbx ubic and so on so therefore uh, you know it, it for me personally it, it's a very good thing that she did she wanted it and I said to her, just, you know, be patient, things will work out. Uh, and yeah, very, very happy with the build. Again, as I said, everything is working perfect. And let's run now to the parts uh, we've used. How much did it cost us? Um, and obviously, I'm going to show you again, as I said, the calculation on the ROI, how much electricity, the wattage, and uh, obviously, the mega hashes uh, she is currently getting out of her rig. So let's begin. First thing first, uh, here is the list. Uh, the frame, I built the frame for her, same frames I've always used, $6 for the frame it costed for me to build it for her. Next thing is the uh, motherboard, uh, same motherboard, the ASRock H81 Pro BTCR 2.0. Uh, we paid $130, I did say to her that, you know, the other motherboards, newer motherboards that she can go for, but no, she just wanted the same as me, so fair enough, that's what she wanted, this is what I did for her, and yeah. Uh, so $130 for the uh, motherboard um, Next thing it was the um, The big wired the PSU dark power pro 11 high-end 1200 watts a very good PSU I, I'm having the same ones. I'm very happy with it. They're really quiet You can barely hear them and they do really good job um, I did say to her that we can go for two uh, PSUs smaller ones uh, and it will cost us a much cheaper probably but she wanted one, so there you have it. Quite pricey, but I still think it's worth the money. So $400 for this one. Next thing is the memory. We went for this memory, this bundle, uh, a Data Premier Pro DDR 1600 megahertz, 8 GB, 4 GB times two. Good memory. And this one actually, we managed to get it cheaper. Uh, we paid for it um, 
well we actually paid for a uh, 75 dollars so here it is 75 dollars still some saving in there next thing is the Kingston UV 400 SSD 120 GB which is this one uh, very good hard drive and we pay the same price as sixty dollars it does the job and it's not very big but for the purposes that it's needed it is perfect size next thing is the Intel Celeron G1840 2.8 GHz again it does very good job for what it's needed uh, and we paid for this fifty dollars only good price in there okay so fifty dollars for this one and the risers guys are uh, the version uh, 6 uh, where they are right here we got a bundle six of them what I was very happy with it that none of them came faulty sometimes when you buy these risers some of them came for come faulty you gotta exchange them and all this um, we were lucky they all came uh, working and yeah we paid actually very good price for them fifty dollars only for six risers all right now by the way when I say very good price for us is at least good this is the cheapest we can find it for you maybe uh, expensive maybe you can find it cheaper than us but this is what we paid for this is the best we could get them for and finally the big big uh, one the beast the MSI gaming X RX 588 GB 6 uh, GPUs and those ones were quite expensive uh, those are the ones right here and yeah in dollars guys they all came to two thousand nine hundred and eighty dollars which is a quite high price from what I paid some time ago but we all know there's a shortage with those uh, GPUs very hard to find out and when you when you very hard to find and when you find them you have to be prepared to pay a bit of price a bit of a price for them and let's see how much actually um, they, they all came around so six uh, 2,900 uh, so each was close to $500 very expensive I'd say but we couldn't find them any any cheaper than that uh, and this is what we paid so the final bill as you can see guys was 3,751 that's all uh, obviously she's a friend of mine there was no cost to pay me to build a rig or anything like that um, so there you have it this is the price she paid she's happy with it Again, as I said, um, same parts as before, and is currently mining uh, Ethereum. Now, moving on to the numbers, um, 176 mega hashes I've managed to uh, obviously set the rig to produce at the moment, and the power watts is very good at 780 watts, and the power cost uh, for her is the same as me, 0.12. I've put the cost at 3,760. You know, obviously. You know it's ten dollars difference or nine dollars it's not a problem well let's put it what it was exactly so three thousand seven hundred and fifty one and calculate and let's see guys I mean she was a bit obviously because she is new and um, we have talked before and I did say and if you also have seen my video in regards to this week and I say things change and obviously the price of Ethereum is a bit lower now well quite lower than what it was and all these things and I said to her just to you know keep calm and everything will work out at the end so she is happy with it yes currently ROI is looking very well it looks like it's gonna take a while to break even uh, nearly a year which uh, you know it could be quite alarming uh, alarming sorry uh, you know looking at 332 days to break even but again this is because the Ethereum is at lower price if it goes to 400 this will uh, without a doubt be much quicker and we're gonna do some calculation now for you but nevertheless here is what she's looking currently to make um, so daily $11 uh, weekly 78.87 monthly $338 and annually $4,112 which again it, it is not the best it could be at the moment but uh, if she holds the coins as I advise her hopefully she won't get scared once the electricity costs start coming as well uh, and if she can hold on to those coins once they Ethereum rises and uh, she will without a doubt uh, you know make much more money than that and I'll give you a small calculation let's open the calculator and let's for instance look at the uh, annually so 21.64 let's say difficulty continue to rise and she only makes 15 coins however if the price of Ethereum at the time she decides to sell goes to 400 so times this by 400 uh, you can clearly see 6,000 therefore uh, she would break even once she does the calculation and all this you know the ROI will be much less than 332 
and obviously the profits will be much bigger but that is a bit of a speculation at the moment we don't know when this will happen if it will happen I'm sure it will but simply you know I don't like speculating on my channel so I don't know when the price will get to that point but even with that guys um, the money are, are like I said to her in your rig in her rig uh, and she can always sell those parts as long as none of them something happened to them so she has the money stuck in the rig so which is good and of course at the same time she will be now uh, earning you know a good amount of money that is not bad passive incomes you know nearly eighty dollars uh, per week why not uh, you know for, for the rig just working in there and I was joking around but it is the truth uh, once the winter comes along it, it could be hitting her room so there you have it no electricity cost for heater in the winter uh, so this is it guys this is the rig this is the cost this is the parts um, feel free to share with me anything you like down in the comment section I don't know uh, what those number will uh, be a bit scary for you especially the ROI looking at nearly a year just to break even some of you may be like oh no it's not worth it to build a rig I still believe uh, it is worth to get involved with mining uh, doesn't matter is it with a cloud mining company or is it building a rig I still believe there's money to be made this is just the beginning and again as I said early on there's many many uh, coins that we can mine and even after Ethereum uh, whatever happens you know after sometimes move to post or whatever we can always switch uh, and continue mining but here it is lovely rig quite expensive I must admit uh, from what I paid, I think I've paid uh, about 2700 something like that. I'll look at the numbers, I'll do a comparison next time. Uh, but again, it is a very good machine, it's producing her good profits, I'd say. Not bad, it could be better and it will be better, but at this moment in time, this is uh, these are the numbers. And yeah, if you do decide to build yourself one, I'll say go ahead. But obviously you got to do your own calculation, your own numbers and see if it's worth it for you. One thing to remember guys is the cost it, it, you know, for us, it could be higher for you or it could be less. Uh, because, uh, I don't know, depending on where you are around the world or depending, you may get some things on sale or something like that. You might find it cheaper somewhere. So, you know, you got to do your own numbers for yourself. This is her numbers. This is how much it costed. Um, again, as I said, a bit expensive. I must admit, I was also a bit surprised, especially for the GPUs. This was where it was the biggest hit, but that's it. Well, you gotta do what you gotta do if you wanna get into the mining. Other than that, um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have, and if you haven't subscribed to my channel, feel free to do so. And uh, yes, yeah, stay tuned. A lot more videos coming up, a lot more talking, and yeah, maybe more rigs to be built. A few more friends are also asking, but we see how things are going, and hopefully. You know, hopefully once the, the graphic cards, the GPU start getting uh, released and people can obviously not so hard to find, maybe the price will drop again and uh, building the rig will be a bit more cheaper than what we've paid now for my friend. But there you have it guys. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.